It is the day before Christmas Eve, the 23rd of December, therefore the 23rd day of Vlogmas. I'm wearing my new Santa shirt that I finally got yesterday. And I thought I would show you one of my favorite pieces of Christmas decor in my mom's house. So these little choir girls and this choir of angels were more ceramics that were painted by my paternal grandmother, my dad's mom, who I never knew, but knew her through her craft. Um, because I always had these angels and I showed you in the nativity and the Santas that she did. So I love these. I love them. They are some of my favorite pieces ever. She even like added a little Noel to the angels <laughs> choir wool. And they have songbook written on theirs. And in addition to that, this is a music box my mom got, I'm sure right after I was born. You can still hear it playing because it's going to play out. But one of my mom's traditions for many, many, many years has been to like sit and play Silent Night on the music box at night before she goes to bed. I caught her doing it once this year. I don't know if she's done it that frequently since I've been home, but I know that's something that she's always done. So I think that's precious. It's still going. So let's go and do some advents. And we have two more pairs of socks. I have no idea what they are. Ooh, these are cute little snowflake ones for today. Those are cute. I'm not gonna spit on those for sure. Okay, I don't even know. Uncle Pop, three. Mm -hmm. Festive goofy, it's time. It's time for festive goofy. Thank goodness, I don't know what I would have done if there had not been festive Goofy. He does abs he absolutely does not stand up. Why do they make them this way? And like from other vlogs I've seen, like all the Funko Advents are like this. Why? Why? Are they just so cheaply made? I don't understand. Oh no, we almost had a tragedy. And they just won't even stand up. It's so sad. It's so sad. Look, it's just a graveyard of Disney. 23 woobles. Hmm. Oh, it's a little woobles tin. It's a Christmas woobly, woobly bits tin. I think that was it. Yeah, so the pens that I got yesterday could go in here. Yeah. And finally, body shop. Okay, 23 is over here. Oh, I got it. I got it. Community fair trade. Oh, I'm tired. <laughs> Aloe in your she mask is made of tough stuff. It's a virtually indestructible plant that can grow into the most infertile terrain. It can grow in the most infertile terrain. When it rains, it's long rubbery stems filled with gel to help it through periods of drought. So, does that mean there's no owl mask? It's a vitamin E sheet mask. Nice. So it's nice and cozy in here right now. My mom will get mad at me for pointing out that these lights right here in the middle have burned out on this tree. We tried replacing them and then more lights burned out. It's just been a mess. Meanwhile, the Santas have their little lights on. In this mess, <laughs> is all gifts from school that I need to put away and sort today. So I will show you some of those. So it's just after seven. I went to sleep around nine something and woke up around two something. It was up until four something. So I didn't have the best night's sleep. I'm not feeling fantastic right now. Um, I'm just very congested mostly. I did have a headache in the night and took some Tylenol and that helped. But 
I had to order groceries. So we'd ordered groceries from Target. Mostly I had um, stocking stuffers and things and that arrived. And then we realized, oh, we didn't make a plan for Christmas morning breakfast, which I think I mentioned in yesterday's vlog. And so we decided we were gonna make a breakfast casserole and strawberry bread. But we needed some things. And so I put in another shipped order and it was supposed to be delivered between, I want to say it was between seven and eight, five and seven, I don't know. But they, they sent me a message saying it can't be delivered until eight to nine. Okay. Then nobody picked it up and I'm like, it's not going to be delivered tonight. <clears throat> they sent me another message that would be between 10 and 11 and then I was able to cancel it. I hadn't been able to cancel it before that because it was too close to, to the delivery window, even though nobody had picked it up, picked up the order, like, you know. Like nobody had been assigned the job. So when I canceled it last night, I'll, I was like, I'll just have it delivered in the morning. And I looked a little bit ago and nobody's picked it up either, which I get. It's the day before Christmas Eve and I'm sure they're either overwhelmed with, with orders or they want to take the day off. I get that. Um, and it wouldn't be such a big deal if I didn't feel like hot garbage on a stick. <sighs> So I may have to venture out today with a mask or something. I'm like 99.9% .9 positive this is just a cold. I haven't had a fever or anything like that. We don't have any COVID tests. We actually do, but I'm pretty sure they're expired. Um, so I'm not sure how accurate they would be. But anyway, so that might happen today. I don't know. I'm hoping it doesn't, but Ellie and I are going to put together a gingerbread house today. We definitely have to clean and get ready because we have company coming over on Monday. Um, and also just, you know, you want the house to be nice for Christmas, as my mom likes to remind me. And I have a lot of gift wrapping to do. I've barely done any. Um, there's a lot to do, but my gift buying is done. Everything has arrived except for one little thing that will be here tomorrow morning. Um... So the shipped order was never picked up. So I am now on my way to the grocery store at 8.40 in the morning, hoping that the crowds won't be terrible. <sighs> Cause it is Christmas Eve Eve after all. So I just wanted to get it over with. I had to call them to cancel it because I was still within like a really close proximity to the time that it was supposed to be delivered but nobody had picked it up, so I don't understand why they won't let you cancel if there's no shipper, shopper person. Anyway, so that's what's happening. So leaving the store, it went really well. It was not crazy busy, and I got a couple of the naked juices. I haven't had this one before, a power C machine, which has like boosted vitamin C. So I'm gonna try this. I usually have the green machine, it's been a while. They don't have a lot of protein, it's a lot of sugar, so usually it doesn't fit into what I want for my macros, but I needed the vitamin C. So got that and a couple of the green machines, and I think I got one other flavor. So I'm gonna drink that on my way home and um, take groceries in and hopefully be productive. Okay, it's a little after 11, and I am about to begin a frenzy of paying bills, editing videos, wrapping presents, Trying to clean this room up, moving gifts in here and putting them away um, from my students. And again, I will try to remember to show you some of those. But they had everything at the store and it wasn't terribly crazy. I think I mentioned that. Um, so now I'm going to attempt to be productive while I still feel okay. <laughs> Obnoxious at all. This one looks pretty. 
Thank you. So we are going to do a different taste test today of snack crate. Make my nails. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we also have this mid-century modern um, gingerbread house to assemble. We'll I thought see how it goes. Six flags. You saw it at Six Flags? No. Oh, you thought it said Six Flags? Yeah. Okay. I did not. So. I'm going to just tear this open with my bare hands. Mother, Yippee! Mother has joined us off camera. Yeah, I am like really, I just finished that Love Has One documentary and this woman like claimed that she was Mother God and so every time I say Mother now it makes me think of that. And it's kind of a creepy moment. So we have Snack Crate. It's much smaller than the Universal Yums. And I think a lot of these we've probably tried in the past. Maybe not, some of these look new. Comes with a little Happy Holidays book and tells you everything that's in here. Whoa. It's from the UK. I don't want to eat that. <laughs> it's Christmas ham with umami truffle glaze. It's more truffle chips. You liked the truffle chips last time. I don't like ham. They're vegan, MSG free, gluten free, non GMO. And. Non flavorful. <laughs> they're full of umami. Umami. I can't tell like if it has. I can't read because I'm old. I'll read. I don't Let's see if it has any but, allergens. Oh, I literally there. can't see. Yeah, right. Without. Oh my god! This is in German, guys. Mm. It says potato chips. Uh. All right. So we're gonna try to. They say have a holly jolly Christmas. Aha! 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 I don't, I don't know if I want to smell. Like, I'm kind of scared. Are you going to try it, I mean? The crisp. Crisp. Crisp? Crisp. Have it here. Yeah, it's kind of like a combination of pubs and... Oh, I don't know. It's thing I've ever tasted. No. That's a no for me. Okay, I'm not going to try it. Oh. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Okay. No. Next up on the docket. I'm pretty sure this has nuts in it. No, actually it doesn't. It has that. egg, milk, and wheat. I They're like Hawaiian that. candy cane cookies. This will clear the palate. Like By diamond. A tip of beef which and salt makes me a little nervous. Maybe you shouldn't try it right because it is literally a nut factory that makes these, but they don't have nuts. Uh -huh. it, it says. What the flip? I want to try this. Wait, what is this? Oh, mm, they're good candy cane cookies. That's a something <laughs> that I don't know what it says. Huh? That's what we need is another cookie. I know. Okay. That's from Sweden. Mm-hmm. Looks like marshmallows. Oh, oh, they are marshmallows. Maybe. I don't know. I don't. I'm not Swedish. I don't know. What is soon there? Smell to the golden. The la chance. Why is there like a freaky like Lego man? I'm gonna so stab him with my mm -hmm. nail. I'm impaling him. Oh! That's better. scary, Grammy. Hmm. Better than marshmallows because I don't like marshmallows. Better than like one of those peanuts, but not the flavor. Mm -hmm. Or bubble gum. Mm. It definitely has a bubble gum flavor. Uh, it's good. Mm -hmm. The one snack that I have tried. <clears throat> My least favorite? I don't like the candy cane cookies best so far. It's never reacted to anything that mm -hmm. Sorry. Mmm, it's like caramel corn. Mm -hmm. <coughs> I'm joking and I. But it has like a Christmas kind of cinnamon -y. I like it. Okay. Do it. Next up on the docket. These are from Spain. Oh. Okay, they're just like marshmallow. They're a gummy, gummy glitter snowflake. Oh. Mm. Um. <laughs> you could use this for a gingerbread house. Some of them are white. <laughs> Why is there a gummy bear? 
Hmm. Why is there a gummy bear in here? Hmm. Is this supposed to be in here? These are good. But why is there a gummy bear? It's a secret surprise. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm gonna blare. I like those. Okay. These are my two faves so far. I like this, I think, the best. Mm -hmm. And the popcorn. Okay. Now we have some Hanukkah chocolates. <gasps> oh no! Remember this? Okay, okay, we're not there yet. <laughs> so we have some um Gilt. Thank you. <laughs> um at least I'm not gonna try these. They're just dark chocolate. I don't know if they're from anywhere. They're a product of Israel, so <clears throat> just break one in half or something. We're gonna try a little one. Tastes like dark chocolate. It's fine. All right. My favorite! Ellie got excited about these. These are dreidel oodles. We've had these before. And they are from Belgium. They're my favorite ever. So this one's uh, blue raspberry. I'm not trying those. What flavor are those? Tiny, tiny tangy fruit It doesn't shoes. say. That one's all the flavors. But what are all the flavors? I think they're designated by the fruit pictures on the front. Wow. Blueberry, blueberry, raspberry, no, cherry, and Why are there two apple. apples? And that's a cherry. Oh. That's all right. You can have these. I don't like blue raspberry. It's dead now. Mm -hmm. Pretty good. Okay. Ooh. I think the remaining items. Oh, here. This has been helpful. Um, allergens, nutritional information. Mm -hmm. If I know. So the rest of these are chocolate, except for the beverage, which is trocamust. It's got to be from an, a, a Nordic country because of the words. On it. What? Let's see. Mm -hmm. It is a product of Sweden. I was correct. All right. I'm it just has caffeine. So I'm going to step away and get some cups. So here's the troca mist. Troca must. Troca must. Troca must. It's like a little fizzy beverage that I'm not really supposed to drink. It does say ho 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 on it. Oh. Festive. Okay, if you like it, there's some more. Okay, ready? It doesn't have any flavor. Oh! Uh, tastes like flat Sprite, even though it has carbonation. Oh, I really liked it. Talking not mess. I kind of like it. You can have the rest of it. Okay, cool. All right, I tried it. Okay, the rest of the items are chocolate, so I know Ellie won't eat them. Ah! So, first of all, we have these two bulk. I had these last time I got the Snack Crate Holiday Box, and I think I liked it, but it might be, I think it's a gingerbread flavored chocolate covered pretzel. It's not a pretzel pretzel. So, there's one if you want it. That's what it is. Sorry, what am I gonna It is from Germany. So clearly, Bill Callitz made these. <laughs> they were in his oh my God. very oh my own God. hands. Yeah, he made the he made the kettle corn too. That's why I ate all of it. It's like a gingerbread with a dark chocolate covering. I didn't bite off that part. Oh, thank you. Oh, okay. Mm. This is established in a shed in Great Britain. Then why is it all these in German? Our Kit Kats, I think these are the UK version. 
And I will tell you from personal experience, the UK Kit Kats and Twix are by far superior to the American ones. What about the Japanese ones? I haven't had the Japanese ones. Oh, before. okay. No. They sell them at okay. Daiso. I'll just try these on my own. <clears throat> Daiso it's has fine. the best <gasps> candy. Oh my gosh, it's like a little like penguin. <laughs> I like penguins. Oh, do I need to do the influencer hand? Okay. Oh, it was almost all over. <laughs> Ow. So these are the remaining items. My battery and my camera died, so I'm not going to be able to Hello. easily set up <laughs> my phone camera. But we have a Milka, which I've had. I've had this before, and I'm pretty sure it was good. This scarf. Actually, this isn't chocolate. And. Flop. <laughs> wow. So I'm gonna save these for another day. I will let you know how they are. So here's the mid-century modern gingerbread cookie kit. Uh, we historically do not have great. I'm gonna do good. Um, luck <laughs> gingerbread cookie kits, but we're gonna try to make it look as much like the picture as possible. This actually has base connector clips, so maybe that'll make it a little bit easier. I don't know. And piping bags, whoa, it's so next level. So Ellie's making the green icing. I already put the white icing into this bag. Oh, there's more candies over there. Candies, other icing pieces, things. So I'm letting the, the two parts of the roof dry. I have this part of the house built. Um, it's kind of a disaster. I think the icing is really clumpy. So it definitely is not gonna look like the picture, but oh well. And we've already like yelled at each other about 25 times. So when I say we, I mean me. I've already been like really grumpy, right? I mean, not that Ellie has not been grumpy because just looking at her face, you can tell she's a grump. Is this accurate? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Fun times so. Fun and responding experience. I have been really grumpy all day today though. I'm not sure why. Probably because I don't feel good. <laughs> it's the final product. Uh, doesn't quite match what's on the box, but we tried. We tried. It's all right. Guys, you know what time it is. It's cool, go calendar time. Oh yeah. Okay. I am a product of the 90s, so I can't help how I am. So it's 23rd, I ripped this box, Avi. And it is a dark chocolate cocoa. Tomorrow's the last day, I'm so sad. Meanwhile, this is the mess that's out here. And I packed one of my mom's presents in one of these boxes. And I can't find it. I think I've opened all the boxes it could be in. I have a vague recollection of taking it out and putting it somewhere. Don't think it's out here. I think it's in my room somewhere. So I need to go look and see if I can find it. I have no idea where I put it. It's got to be in a box, but I don't know which box it could possibly be in. <laughs> it's so ridiculous. Meanwhile, Cricket Calendar for December 23rd. Two days left. Oh my gosh. So they're kind of an orangey golden color this time. So I have to figure out how to incorporate these into my planner this year. I almost forgot to do Cadbury tonight. That would have been a travesty. I don't see 23. Here it is. Ah, this stupid fudge. I don't like those. So I'm about to shower. Um, Parish came and got Ellie, and tomorrow's Christmas Eve. I can't believe it. I still have several presents to wrap. I never found the one for my mom. I did my backup plan instead. I have no idea what I did with it. It's so ridiculous. But um, we go to my aunt and uncle's tomorrow afternoon for kind of a Christmas Eve dinner. And then they'll come over here Christmas Day around the same time um, for Christmas Day dinner. So 
Anyway, I'm going to shower and read and reflect on my life choices this Christmas season because I feel like there's a lot of things that I didn't get to do that I really wanted to. I mean, we never went and looked at Christmas lights. I mean, it's possible we will tomorrow. Um, barely made a dent in my Google's calendar and the other kits that I got. Um, I could still do them. It doesn't have to be Christmas time. But anyway, so I have a basket full of Wubble pieces. And yeah, I have all these books that I got that I haven't read. So I'll save them for next year probably. Christmas time, since they're all Christmas themed. I would like to finish this one I've been working on. Um, I don't think I'll finish it before Christmas. But anyway... That's about it. So thank you for sticking out with me once again. And please comment, like, or subscribe. And I will see you guys tomorrow on Christmas Eve. Bye.